on me. Double in. Take an E. I've got no home to go to. You're in your own time now. Mighty as a salad. The Gan. The Stan. Sandpit. Incoming. Up 804 men jumping. Fibula, CFT, Mucker, Fella, Negus Cheggers, Boss, Sarge, etc. 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 Get a fucking life, Gareth. Keep shouting, sir. We'll find you. Sweet bubby Jesus. That smells like sperm with the shit chaser. Actually it's a RP, or as we soldiers like to call it, a rat pack. Lamb stew and dumplings. I was with the TAs this weekend. You got ping stab. If you'd said that whilst sporting a 9 inch cock, thicker than a Danny's forehead, and the body of a regular soldier I would still hate you and everything you represent you commitment faux part timing cunt. You savit art. Wait until you see me in my combat soldier 95 uniform and VRSM you'll be wetter than an otter's feet then. You rancid cunt. The thought of you tiktoking whilst chewing gum on a remembrance parade makes me fucking cringe. I need to hurt you. Whilst I'm beating you to the floor you can put it down on the attendance sheet as fizz. I find your attitude offensive. I've put my name down twice for Gan as I'll have you know. Unfortunately Impetigo prevented my going, but I miraculously managed to deploy on Optoscar instead. Six months in the sand pit away from my family. It was hell, I can tell you. I swear to god I'm going to knack you right now. Your scrawny, pasty body, coupled with the photos you display on your desk of you carrying a jimpy in the track makes me gag. By the way, a combat jacket with tatty green issue socks sewn on the cuffs does not make it a fucking parasmock. The zips in your boots combat high also indicate that your CFT time is a date on a calendar. You fucking savvy. It's squad is like me who kept back the red hordes every Tuesday night. I was willing to die in the tack bar if the Ruskers invaded Germany. There's bile flooding my mouth. Put the racing spoon you carry around in the Nyrex in your pocket to good effect and eat out my ass. Also, if I ever see you wearing a set of green army socks with your suit again I'll remove one of your eyes. As long as it's not my sniper eye pet. I'm going to fucking glass you. I'll practice my unarmed combat on you. Lance Corporal Smith demonstrated it last Tuesday night by playing a WWF video. I claimed a quarter day's pay for that plus T and S. You money grabbing fucking no mark. Hey, I joined up for my country. It's my calling. You can't join up your handwriting you silver shadow wearing cunt. The only calling you get is stab cunt from everyone who has the misfortune to see you wearing DPM and a beret shaped by a gendarme. What would you know? I'm now going to quote you values and standards from Mat6. This is a favorite tactic of part-timers, especially on internet forums where we routinely berate those nasty regular soldiers who mock us. We call them Arabs, even though 99% of us have yet to see one in the flesh, or to even deploy further than Stanter. My eyes have actually glazed over. I'm praying for a stroke to take all memories of this conversation away from me. In a medical emergency you'll be in safe hands as I've recently attended a BCDT lecture to qualify for my bounty. In TA terms that means I'm a fucking paramedic with a pass on the hills phase of selection, which as a matter of interest, I'd recommend wearing high-tech magnums for cracking boots. I can get you a discount from Cadet Direct. You fucking balloon head. Throw yourself from the top of the building. Not a problem. I recently completed a PFT as part of my bounty requirements. In TA terms that means I've just completed P company in my jumps course, including 6 jumps, although no night jump. Prepare for action. Action stations. Number 1, stand in the door. Feet and legs together. Steer away I'm on my reserve. Etc, etc, etc. I've just drank a liter of bleach to wash down 24 dish fosher tablets. You vomit inducing wearer of 1980s disruptive pattern material. You're on the piss kit is Ron Hills and an olive green fleece. Goodbye cruel world.